You don't want no problem, no problem with me If one more label try to stop me There's gonna be some dreadhead hitters in the lobby You don't want no problem, want no problem with me You don't want no problem, want no problem with me Just another day, had to pick up all the mail With an Alex riding through the streets, they be like, there he go all right, hi guys. So we're just gonna start up all close and personal. Mm -hmm. So the only thing that I have did is my eyebrows and I primed my eyes and I also set them with my usual stuff that I do it with. So now we're just gonna go on into the eyeshadow. So I'm taking this Milani eyeshadow palette and this is in the earthy elements one I'm just gonna take this brown color right here and I'm gonna use this as my transition color and then I'm gonna take my usual brush that I use which is just like a flat stippling brush and I'm just gonna work this into the crease So now we're going to go on and we're going to go grab some darker colors. So this is a Profusion little eyeshadow kit. I'm just going to take this color right here. This, not that one, this one. And I'm just going to pop that into it. And I'm just going to use the darker brown. So I'm just going to take a pretty clean brush and it's a fluffy brush. It's probably the cleanest that I have. Um, and this is a Wet n Wild brush and it was only 99 cents. I don't know why that's like that. But these brushes are really good. You can find them at Dollar Tree. You can find them at Kmart. You can find them anywhere where they sell some wet and wild stuff that's where you can find it so um they're very fluffy they're very soft um and they're also cruelty free and vegan so we're just gonna take this brush that is pretty clean and we're just going to go around the edge of the eyeshadow because i want to diffuse that and make it softer What I'm going to do is get this pencil brush. This pencil brush right here. This is a very stiff pencil brush. I use this for mostly when I do my black eyeshadow, like in a cut crease or something like that, just to define the crease some. So I'm just going to take this color, the black color right here, and pop that into my crease. And then I'm going to take my diffusing brush, that's what I'm going to call it, 
and just go on the edges and diffuse out the eyeshadow to make it softer um, and not so harsh. That go. I'm gonna use this color right here for the like base for the glitter. Going to go in with my transition color brush and just blend out, you know, just to blend some more. I'm gonna go in with this brush that I use for the black. Let's go back in with that. So the glitter that I am using today is actually some craft glitter. Um, I got it from Michaels and it comes with six in total. So it looks like this is still in the packaging. And it was only $4.99. And with Michaels you also get, you can buy, um, you can get 40% off of one regular priced item and this was not on sale so I got 40% off of that so you know it wasn't $4.99 really so I just have the glitter in there and you always need something to have your glitter to stick on with and I just have this eyelash glue um, any eyelash glue would work this is the strip lash adhesive and this is from kiss I believe yeah it's from kiss and this also has aloe this is also a really good eyelash glue like for eyelashes the eyelash glue has to be clear it cannot be like black the black kind um so what I'm gonna do with this is I'm just going to put it all over my lid what I should probably do is just go in sections so that's what I'm gonna do So I'm just going to take this makeup wipe and I'm also going to remove like some of the glitter that will come off. Let's see if y'all can see. Y'all see that glitter that's coming off my face? So I'm just going to take that and we're just going to also clean up the makeup look. Okay, so I put on my eyeliner and I also did my eyelashes. Put on some eyelashes this look will look great with some faux lashes but I don't have any because I really don't wear them
All right, so I have finished all of my face makeup. I got my highlight on, going on, and stuff like that. So now we're just going to finish up the eyes. For the inner corner of my eye, um, let me see. I'm gonna be probably taking it from the Morphe F palette. And I'm going to be using, we're gonna try to use that color. The lightest color of the palette. And we're just gonna put that in the inner corner. All right, so now that we have that done, we're gonna do the bottom lash line. And I'm just going to take me a pencil brush. So a brush like this. And I'm going to take that Profusion palette that we were using and we're gonna use that first color that we were using. And just pop that on the bottom left line. Okay, and that is the finished look, you guys. I hope that you enjoyed this makeup tutorial. I am so pleased with it, especially for my first time, like with using glitter, any type of glitter. I am, I'm pretty pleased with it. Y'all just tell me in the comments below if you liked it. And if you did like this tutorial, make sure that you hit the thumbs up button and to keep up with any of the videos that I will be posting in further dates make sure that you hit the <sighs> make sure you hit that subscribe button y'all um it would mean so much to me so enough with me feeling myself i will see you guys in the next video bye